everybody today from my kitchen i'm going to show you how we can make the kusa mahshi it's uh, it's one of our lebanese best delicious dish in kitchen so it's uh, i'm going to use this green zucchini or courgette or um, squash so as you like it you can call it but we call it a courgette or zucchini so i'm i'm using this one here i have about one and a half kilo uh, it's very easy and simple so we, we're going to stuff the courgette but first we're going to empty the inside and uh, I'm going to show you how so first step so first step what I'm going to do you need to take off the bottom like this and take off the head like, like so take off this bit and a little bit from the Bottom. okay so we're going to do all of them and also we need to pick up all the inside to stuff the zucchini so what I'm going to do I'm going to use uh, this one especially for courgette it's metal picker so I'm going to take the, that one and do it like this like this like so how I'm working so just put it like so and then start rolling it but be careful because be careful if you break it, it will open from here so keep rolling it like this and empty all the inside okay like so so feel it and then pick up all the white inside there's people they make food on them like um, saute with onion and garlic but myself I don't like this this kind of food so I like only the zucchini so I'm going to throw the inside and this is the first one here we go so we empty the inside as you can see should be like this empty from inside I'm going to show you how we can make on another one so easy and simple we pick all the white from inside the zucchini it's easy job so I want to carry on doing all the courgette off camera and after that see from inside and after that I'm going to wash them very good from inside and outside and we get, I'm going to show you how we can make the filling we need the mincemeat and rice it's like grape leaves how we can fill the grape leaves so stay with me okay guys so here we go after I clean the zucchini and I wash them like this and put them like this this side to to drain all the water from inside so I'm going to show you how we can make the filling so first we need one cup of washed rice so we need washed rice and I'm going to add on them about half a teaspoon of salt and half a teaspoon of seven spices and also I'm going to add a little bit of uh, fresh black pepper so I'm going to crush them like this that will give a nice taste and also I'm going to add half teaspoon of 
butter and here I have uh, mashed garlic we need mashed garlic for to cook the zucchini but I'm going to add about one teaspoon of mashed garlic with the filling and I'm going to add finally the mincemeat so I'm going to mix them very well my hand so mix them okay guys so after I mix the the filling I'm going to say what, what I added here I add uh, lamb mincemeat and um, beef mincemeat as a luck you can add beef uh, beef or lamb but I like to mix them because I don't want the um, meat to be very dry so that's why we add rice uh, black pepper, a little bit of mashed garlic, a little bit of butter, um, butter is optional and you have to add uh, salt and spices. So now we are going to start, fill the courgette like this, just fill it like, so don't press it in your finger because you know that the rice is going to double size. So just leave it like this. Okay. Here we go. So each one is going to take about two tablespoons of filling. Uh, I'm going to leave a little bit of space on top, like so. And I'm going to carry on. Fill the zucchini. Okay, so now after we finish stuffing the zucchini, now I'm going to show you how we can make, how we can prepare the sauce. First, I have two uh, chicken stock, which is make the food so rich and nice. If you don't like to add, you can add salt, so it's up to you, and you need to add water and melt the chicken stock. Okay. So I'm going to melt the chicken stock here. Okay, I'm going to add the rest of the mashed garlic, about two tablespoons of mashed garlic. We need to add seven spices and a little bit of salt as well, just a little bit. We need to add a little bit of mint, dried mint. You can add fresh mint as well, and that will give a nice taste to the kusa. We need to add a three tablespoon of tomato paste, and also one teaspoon of butter. And I'm going to add a little bit of black pepper. Here we go, just half a teaspoon. And as you can see, I have um, the rest of the filling. You don't need to add this, um, you know, amount of filling, but I have to because I'm going to do as well grape leaves, stuffed grape leaves. So if, if you was doing this uh, dish and you still have a little bit of filling, you can add them with the sauce, doesn't matter. But I need them for the grape leaves and I already uploaded a video of how we can make stuffed grape leaves, the Lebanese one. So please check my other videos. Here we go, that smells so yummy. So I'm going to put the courgette in the sauce and cook them for about uh, 40 minutes or between 30 to 40 minutes exactly they don't need more than that okay so we're going to check them later now I'm going to cover them so I'm going to cover them like this okay guys here we go this is after 40 minutes exactly so the kusa is ready now I'm going to take kusa and serve them in a nice bowl 
and also in that time I'm preparing uh, grape leaves stuff grape leaves wow so this dish very healthy tastes so yummy and also it's easy and I'm going to add wild lettuce on top for decoration and a little bit of the sauce on top oh my god whoops <sighs> wow 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 really so delicious guys i hope you enjoy this lebanese dish kusa mahshi or oh, stuffed zucchini and i hope you find it easy so please leave me like on this video if you enjoyed and subscribe for more videos and stay tuned and i will see you soon in another video or another recipe of food enjoy bye